sekarang yang terjadi terobosan itu menjadi mungkin oleh yang namanya saya ulang oleh yang namanya ilmu pengetahuan oleh yang namanya teknologi oleh yang namanya inovasi in 2020 Indonesia entered a new national development era on this term President Joko Widodo administration turned its focus on developing Indonesia's human capital and mastery of science and technology through Indonesia's national research priorities. The quality of a country's research and innovation is a national asset. As a key step, the government issued Law No. 11, 2019 on the National System of Science and Technology or the Cisnas Iptek Law. By issuing the law, the government of Indonesia was signaling more attention to and commitment for the growth of the research and innovation during the next phase of Indonesia's development. Nine research fields are listed as the focus fields of Indonesia's 2017-2045 National Research Master Plan. Food Energy Health Transportation Engineered Products Defense and Security Maritime Social, Humanities, and other research fields. These are expected to be able to produce innovative products. In order to address institutional problems of fragmentation among government institutions and the inefficiency of the budget allocation, the National Research and Innovation Agency, or BRIN, was established in 2019 with the Presidential Regulation No. 74 of 2019 on the National Research and Innovation Agency. The President has tasked BRIN to ensure that research and development activities in the country could attract more investments to its science and technology sectors, integrating research and innovation resources, creating and open a collaborative global standard research ecosystem, and creating the foundation of a strong and sustained research and innovation-based economy are three directions of BRIN. The contribution of research and innovation to produce a variety of solutions can resolve the challenges faced by the government, industry, and society.